Yo, what's good guys? It's sick Dars here. Yeah, I'm sick. Don't mind my voice. Today's video is gonna be a little bit different. We're gonna be showing you guys how to get zero textures in Roblox Rivals so your game could be FPS boosted and look a lot better. A lot of people have asked me to do it, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you how. This is what the game looks like when you have zero textures. What I'm saying it looks so much cleaner, you know, everything's a lot easier to see. The game is a lot cleaner, and uh, actually, this is actually a trick. If you turn your graphics up, your weapons and stuff actually start to glow, which is really, really nice. I, that's one of the things I actually like about this. And this is actually the Nebula wrap right here, so it's just white and pink, and it looks really nice. The no textures mode makes the wraps look really clean, you know, they make them glow, it's pretty cool. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to get your game like this. So what you guys want to do is go to this website right here, um, lostrap.pizzaboxer.xyz. I'll link it down below so it's easier for you guys to access. This is what gives you the gray sky, you know, the no textures, FPS boost, all of that. You just click right here, download the latest version. And if you guys can't find it like me, you search up Blockstrap menu and it doesn't pop up. Go to add or remove programs and find Blockstrap, click modify. Press yes, and it should bring up the block strap menu right here. And yeah, just go to the description, copy the fast flags. You can copy my settings too, turn on these, copy and paste the fast flag into here. And make sure you press save, make sure you press save, because if you don't save it, if you exit out without saving it, your game is going to look just the same. And once it's installed, you guys will see integrations, mods, fast flags, all of that. Integrations aren't really important, but the mods and stuff, this is just for like, Appearance basically old avatar editor background full character sounds all that stuff And this is right here is what we're gonna be focusing on is the fast flags So this is what helps you boost your game boost your FPS This is also what gives you the gray sky and all the textures and stuff So I disabled player shadows that's on disabled post processing effects That's also on and disabled terrain textures. It's also on this is what like helps you boost your FPS and then frame rate limit I have it at 9999. This is basically the frame rate unlocker. This would basically help you get more than 240 frames if you can. The fast flag editor. This is what's extremely important right here. Is the fast flag editor. This is what gives you the gray sky. You know, no textures, lighting, all that stuff. This is this is what it is right here. If you guys don't have a fast flag? Just press add new, and it shows import JSON. Go to the description, copy it, and then paste it into here. And yeah, and then once you do that, click OK. It'll say this, we're importing very large, just press yes. And then some of the flag, this is because I already had it, just press yes. Yeah, it should show all of this stuff, it's okay. And then press save. It says changes will take effect next time you launch Roblox. That's how you get your game to look like this. And it looks really, really nice. It looks freaking actually beautiful, especially with the glowing wraps. I'll play a couple games for you guys just to show you guys how it looks in game, because I know it's a little bit different in the shooting range. So let's do that. As you guys can see, there's no textures at all. It's just, everything's just all gray. You know, all my weapon wraps are loading. It's really nice. It's really nice. Oh, no, this guy's a shotgun user. Hold up. Come here, boy. Get 13 damage. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. One thing I do want to note is that having no textures will bug out some of the weapons, like the sniper, for example. The sniper looks a lot different, it has this like square look, and it's like a lot darker through the scope. And when you get hit, there's this giant red square that pops up on your screen to show the hit marker where you got, where you got hit from, so. If you guys are okay with that, I'll download it, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I feel like no textures is a lot better, it helps the game run a lot better, you know what I'm saying? A lot smoother, and yeah, this is how it looks in-game. Freaking shotgun spammer, bro. There you go. As you can see, the weapons look absolutely amazing. Like, everything is glowing, you know what I'm saying? This is what the Nebula wrap looks like, the little the galaxy one. It's just white and pink, and it, it starts glowing. It looks really nice. It's like basic, but it's 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 clean, you know? It's better. It's, it's a lot easier to see the person that you're shooting at, too. And those people who have the arena skins, you know, try to blend in. Because that skin has lines and stuff on it. If they have it in here, they won't really blend in because, you know, it, it gets rid of all the textures, so you'll be able to see the person a lot easier.
I'm not really trying hard. That's why I'm missing. Oh my gosh, I'm missing everything. And this guy just killed me. All right, let me secure this dub and stop yapping to you guys so you guys can use these settings real quick. Yeah, but, you know, the gray sky, everything's literally, like, gray. It's just, it makes the game look so much better. Yep, that's how it looks in-game. That's how you get the gray sky, no textures. I'll put the block strap link in the description. I'll put the flash flags link in the description as well. Also, put this eat, sleep, rivals, repeat sweatshirt in, in the description as well, if you guys want to buy that. And, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.